everyone, it's Jordan, and I'm back with another huge thrift haul. Um, this thrift haul is going to be a bit larger than usual because I have been losing weight and I've been needing some new clothes um, for the first time in a while because normally I would say I have too many clothes, but um, not all of them fit anymore. So uh, a couple of these things are from the Goodwill and a couple are from garage sales, but I'll be sure to tell you which ones are from which. And um, so I'm going to start off with shoes. Um, I got these uh, Nike sneakers. These are the Dart 9. Um, these are my size. I was really excited because they were only $7. Um, they're a nice uh, blue color with green, and I'm not sure if the green's glow in the dark because it looks like it would be, but I'm um, not sure. Uh, it didn't come with laces, so I put in my own laces. But uh, these are my go-to workout shoes. I love these, and they were only seven dollars uh, in comparison to. Um, I think they'd be around seventy or eighty dollars for these. Um, the next ones I got are by hmm, Sakomi, and I know Sakomi is a nice brand. These are also in my size, and these ones were also seven dollars. It still says on the bottom. I haven't worn them yet because they don't match a lot of my stuff, but. Um, yeah, these are really nice, sort of like these, this pair, but, um, yeah, my mom found these for me. I still like them. They still have some paper inside the toe to, um, keep their shape. These are really nice, and, yeah. So, the next thing I got is something I bought just yesterday, and it is amazing. This is a red velvet kimono by a brand called Nurture, and it is so cute. It's really hard to show on camera how pretty it is, but it has very wide sleeves with uh, tassels on just the sleeves, and it has kind of a crisscross pattern with the tassels. It's a nice red color. Uh, there's no tassels on the back. They're just on the sleeves, but uh, this is gorgeous, really comfy, um, and when I bought it, it was new. It had no signs of wear, and I love this. Um, I did take a picture of the outfit I wore yesterday, and it included this, so I'll be sure to link that image down below. Uh, the next thing I got are a pair of yoga pants, nothing interesting. Um, these are by a brand called Asian, and they feel really nice. They're just fold over black yoga pants. Um, they look to be not really cropped, but more of like a, a mid-calf. Uh, these were size medium, and these were, I believe they were 269 That's how much uh, workout clothes are at the Goodwill. Um, really soft, stretchy. What else can you expect out of a yoga pants. Next thing I got is something I really love. It's still in its hanger because it's a dress and I hang up on my dresses, but it's this nice uh, sort of color block dress from Forever 21. It has these pockets right here, but they're um, faux pockets so they don't open. And it has a zipper down the back, just black and white. It's from Forever 21 and it's a size medium. All the dresses at my Goodwill are $5.99 by the way, so if I don't say the price, know that most of them are $5.99. Uh, really nice. It's just cotton. Uh, it hits perfectly. It's uh, something you can dress up or dress down. If I want to dress it up, I'll just wear a blazer, some tights, and flats, and if not, I'll just wear my boots and a jacket, which is what I did the other day. The next thing is another dress. It is a... how do I describe it? It's sort of a nude pink with uh, white lace details. It's a high neck, and it zips down the back so you can get it on. Um, when I bought it, it had no brand but it's sort of like a skater style and I haven't worn it yet because it's a bit more fancy but I just thought it was so cute and it's a nice thin fabric um, just really girly and lacy and the detailing on the lace is really pretty if you can see that but yeah this would be really nice if I have like a job interview or something I'll wear that or um, for something more formal with some nude heels the next thing I got is something I'm not really sure about um, it's a Lily Pulitzer shift dress this is a size 8, so it's a bit big for me, but uh, it was new when I bought it. It has no signs of wear. It's just a white lace one. And I put it on. It looks okay, but I'm pretty sure I'll just end up giving it to my mom because I know she'll like it better, and she'll either wear it or sell it if she doesn't like it. I don't know. But, um, yeah, I bought it mostly because it was Lily, and uh, it was five ninety nine. so, um, yeah. The next thing I got is something that's a little silly. It's a sweater from Forever 21, and it's a size medium. Uh, this was $3.69 because of how much sweaters are. It has dinosaurs all over it. Uh, I just thought this would be nice, like, 
um, for more of a lazy day or if I just finished working out and I just want to put on a sweater. Um, it's really soft on the inside. Uh, it has a little bit of wear, but I really like dinosaurs and stuff like that. So yeah, I picked that up. The next thing I got is something I bought yesterday with the red kimono and it's a skirt from PacSun. I'm pretty sure it's from the Kendall and Kylie collection, correct me if I'm wrong, but it's a daisy skirt. Um, not really that interesting, it has elastic on the back. Uh, skirts at the Goodwill are either $2.69 or $3.69, I don't remember. But it's really cute, it's never been worn. Uh, it's by Kira, and it's a size medium. I thought this was really cute for the summer to wear with um, like a black bandeau or sort of a crop top like that, it's really cute. The next thing I got is another tank top. This is by Lauren Conrad. It's a size large and it's just a beige lace tank top. It has, it just has a lace overlay. It's really um, flowy and loose. I just thought it was cute. I'm not sure how I'd wear it right now. Mm -hmm. Maybe with like a black skirt or something. I'm not sure. Um, thought this was really cute and I really like lace. The next thing I got is sort of just like that. They're almost identical, but it's a uh, lace tunic by what's the brand love fire it's a size small um, this could be a dress for someone who's really short but for me I could not pull this off as a dress um, it's just like a lace tank top sort of like the one I just got um, they're really similar uh, this was 269 that's how much tank tops are the next thing I got is a favorite I love this dress so much it's sort of short, so it's more for summer, but it has thick straps, and it's by O'Neill, I think. Yeah, O'Neill. It's a size small. It's $5.99 because it's a dress, and I love this. It looks so good on me because it's loose, but it doesn't look like a maternity dress, but this is so pretty, so comfy, and it's perfect for summer. Um, the straps are like that in the front and in the back. Um, they're sort of cut off right there. This is really, really comfy, really soft. Next thing I got is something I got for working out, and it's a Victoria's Secret pink sweater hoodie. Let me zip it up so you can see it better. It's um, Heather Gray. Um, it's in really nice condition. Here we go. The only detail on the front is the dog right there, and on the back it just says pink. Um, this is really basic, um, but I liked it, so I bought it. <laughs> Next thing is another blouse that I love. This is by a brand called Allie and Chris, and it's a size small. It's this uh, gorgeous eggplant purple blouse with black lace on the front, and the back is uh, like cut out, but it's still connected. And the sleeves I love because they are um, like big sleeves that billow out, but they come in at the sleeves, and they actually fit me, which is good because. Um, I have really tiny wrists, so some sleeves just don't really like stay on my wrist, but I do love this. Um, I put it over a black skater dress because it is very sheer, and it's really, really gorgeous. I love this top. This was $3.69. That's how much blouses are. Next are another pair of pants that I definitely needed because um, I have lost weight and I need new pants. These are sort of a legging material. I almost thought they were golf pants. But I bought them and they were new with tags and they're by a brand called Zach and Rachel. They're this thick legging type material and the print once again looks like golf pants but I love these. They look really cute with a black tank top and a black sweater. The pattern is sort of not so much checkered but uh, it's black and white squares. These are really comfy and um, they're like the perfect length for me. I don't need to cuff them up. They're not too short. I wear them with like black boots, stuff like that. Next is something that I was really happy to find. It's a Forever 21 sweater, but it's by their, uh, it says exclusive design. I'm not sure what that means, but um, it still has a tag on it, and it's a size small, and it says 2280 on the tag. It has the regular tag, and then it has the one that says it's exclusive design. Um, this is, um, what color pink? Sort of rosy pink uh, sweater, and it's one of those fuzzy sweaters that's really soft. Um, it's getting too hot to wear this, so I'll probably just save it for winter. But, um, yeah, I don't know. Just a pink fuzzy sweater. Next is another sweater that was new with tags that I bought. This is really cropped. I tried it on 
and it was really short on me so I might give it to a friend if I don't end up finding a way to wear it but it's um, from one of the Chinese wholesaler brands this one is Le Zhu Meng it still has the tag on it if I could read Chinese I would tell you what it says but I can't um, it's sort of like a geometric Aztec pattern. It's very, very soft. Um, it's not cashmere wool or anything, but it is still really soft. Uh, this was 369 how much letters are. Next is something that I did not buy at the Goodwill. I got to the yard sale, and it's a North Face jacket. This is the, uh, I think it's called Dry Fit? Oh, no, it's Flash Dry. And it's just a dark gray uh, North Face jacket in my size. Um, it's fleece and it's really light. It's not as um, thick as I thought it would be. This is really nice just to throw on over like a sports bra after I'm done working out if I don't want to um, put on a shirt but it's still a little cold. Um, I got this for two dollars as opposed to 80 or 90 which was really good. Um, yeah, I was really happy about this. Next thing I bought is from the thrift store and it's this crocheted cardigan sort of thing. I thought this would be a good beach cover-up. It's by a brand called Cactus, but it's spelled with a K. Um, it's a size medium, and it's just beige, beige crochet with these ties on the sides and these uh, big brown buttons. Um, I haven't worn this yet, but I will definitely bring this to the beach when I go over the summer. Next is a really good find that my mom got for me at the Goodwill, and it's a Topshop UK um, jumpsuit. It has a belt on the back, but it's just a black jumpsuit that has crisscross straps in the back, buttons down the front, and then the back has pockets, and then like this little belt thing that you can tie. Um, she thought it would fit me a little looser because it was a size 10, and I tried it on, it did not fit because it's a UK size 10, which is about like a 4 in American, correct me if I'm wrong, but um, I was really excited because I love Topshop. Um, I know, this is so cute. Um, I'll just wait till it fits me. I'll keep it and wait till it fits me. Um, I'm just really excited about this because it is adorable. So, can't wait till it fits me. Next thing is something that's not really a thrift thing because I got it at a boutique by my house, and it's a wild fox sweater. Um, this was sixteen dollars, and I was so happy to find it because I've always wanted a wild fox sweater. And um, the only thing I could find online about this is that it's from like two thousand eight. And the only other thing I found was that Miranda Cosgrove wore it. I don't know if that's important, but I don't really care. But I thought this was so cute. It just has smiley face all over the front and smiley face all over the back. It's a size small and it fits big because I do know their sweaters run big. Um, so, I don't know. That was $16, which is good for a wild fox sweater. Not really thrift store price, but I wanted to include it in here because I love it so much. Um, so yeah, that's it. Um, I'll be sure to include outfit. Uh, photos underneath in the down bar to show you um, how I styled some of this stuff. But that's all. Um, make sure to subscribe, thumbs up, like, whatever it is, and let me know what you guys want to see in the future. Bye!